Happy Halloween! Ooh. So we have the October. <laughs> <laughs> that was me dog. We've just been saying she's a bit windy tonight. Apologies in advance for any little noises one might hear. <laughs> yeah. That went a bum though. No, that was just a throw up. I don't know what that was. Uh, anyway. <laughs> Can we get back to being professional ish? We both have a box. Pink parcel. This is the. Oh, yeah, you can show them because mine's got a big thing on it. Where's yours? I don't know. So, how did it get delivered? I don't know. What? I don't know. You must know. I don't know. Pass to a technical question. So mine came like that, tracked, and then it's come like this. Mine was hand delivered by the owner himself, obviously, um, because I'm the queen. Okay. Have we got the right ones before we start morning, yeah? Yep. Yeah, in a brown box. Don't know what I'm saying. This is, oh, yes, because it's the new launch. Yes. After all these emails we've had about and all the problems we've had saying ever so sorry, ever so sorry, it will get fixed by April, it will get fixed by June. They did promise it'd be October. So we was hoping, but we weren't living out that much hope, but apparently something's changed because we've got a smaller box because it used to be longer. It used and to be grey with pink tiles and pink. And now you can't really pick it up. But you can't see it on there, but it's, it's back to Indented front. pink parcel on there. For when you open it, it's quite hard to see. To see on the camera, but there you go. Yes. So when you open it up, we have this. Should we take them out or? Yeah, take them out. Because they're part of the thing, aren't they? There. Now spot the difference right away. <laughs> Half of my bags fell out. Right. If you notice, I've got something there, have I not? Which she hasn't got. I don't have. Ha. So and they've changed the names of it, so instead of the bag, that's still called For Now. For Now, that's as our... Uh... Oh, we've got to talk about this too. And again, that's changed, because it used to have... Bloody dealers in that nobody uses. And your normal, for me, sandwich towels. However, in this one, I've got my knives. Don't know why. But that's the way it is. Guys, also, can I just mention if Alison gets one of them out as well? Another one? <laughs> Sorry, my dog's just done us now. Okay. Mm. Get one of them pads out. Yes, boss. Because this is the last time you will see this. See the female symbol there? It's no longer going to be Not identified allowed. as female. Because men can have periods too. Transgender people and non-binary people are periods so therefore it has to be removed by always and always have been accepted but um, we will move on okay i'm not allowed to even comment on the fact you that can comment you need female genital organs and and equipment to be able to have a period that is true but it's also not pink parcels fault. i just think they've bowed to ridiculous pressure because i'm sorry if you haven't got the equipment <laughs> yeah whether you're male or female, if you haven't got the equipment, if you've had an hysterectomy and you're female, you won't be buying a pink parcel and you won't be buying sandwich towels, will you? No. Right then, so they've also changed these boxes. Yes, they're still the grey with the pink writing on. But they're called now needs. I need. Now needs are what you think, what you basically need. And in that one, I've got all my normal pads and you've got tampons. Yeah. So we've got the same quantities, we did double check, squashed into the bag and... Which is good because all they used to put in them bags and them so stupid it's flimsy things. So saved on packaging, has it not? Yeah. So we've got, we're down to two boxes in a bag, we used to have three boxes in the bag. And the main part is here. Yes, yeah, the favourite bit we like to order and have a chat about is the once, once box. box. Now, before we be hoping the bag box, on top of all this, when we opened our box, not quite sure why. But we've, we've got a little notebook. A token one. From Coconut Lane in London. Now, we had no mention of this book in 
anything. But if you wanted to write down how bad our periods are, we've got something to do it with now. But we did Google it, and we Googled Coconut Lane, London, and it's coming in at a whopping four pound fifty for that. For what I would call an exercise book at school. No, exercise books are thicker, and, and they're they are, aren't they? Yeah, this is just a note notebook. book. I have preferred line paper. Well, like I can say, when you're on a period, that's just what you want, isn't it? <laughs> we don't understand why we've got a token notebook. Uh, stationary. Explanation. Does stationary make you feel better? Man, I suppose it might. Some people might really love stationary. Yeah, but some people well, probably will write down their period thing, but it's a bit plain. It's not like it's got any Well, I can have a bigger mode on mine. Yeah, but I would go off Because my periods last forever. So we're a bit befuddled, but that. thank you. Yeah, I mean, we're not really complaining. It was just a bit of a random thing to put in. But we're not complaining because it was additional to the things that in the box. Yeah. Now, on top as well, we, we also have got a pamphlet, which of course we will be having the tea. Joining the tea club. I don't think so. Again, we're off black. So it's expensive cup of teas. Which we will not join. But you do get £5 off. If you guys order. want it, join the tea club. Get £5 off pink tea. There you go. You can have ours. Some people will love the tea. But th this is it. Now, if I remember right, we had this tea bag with these from last time. So we've now, got if, another one. Yeah, if you saw last month. I know we're a bit slow this month. But if you saw last month, um, it was the first tea I've experienced... Tasted like tea. tea. Oh, a mild light tea, but it was tea, so I can understand people might liking them teas. Mm -hmm. When that, we normally we puking. Do you have a pink post? No, we have no pink post. Okay, we'll just make it up as we go along. <laughs> all right then. Uh, first, first of all, Alison, you start. Right. Well. We have had these before. No, I have. Yeah, well, you have. In glossy box. Other boxes are available. Thank you. Right, so we, yeah, I know we've had, we've, we've tried them before. And I, for some reason, with thick hair that I can't manage with, have got uh, hair vitamins from Hair Flick. Hair Flick! <laughs> 16 pound a jar. Yes, so apparently it's one a day, isn't it? Yeah. One a day. It's a food supplement. Oh, well, travel size. Uh, raspberry. Blue raspberry flavour. Be nice. Hmm. Yeah, but if I take one of these, I'll probably end up with a bear bear one. What, we're trying them? Yeah. You want it, you just want one. I want you to have You haven't got none. She haven't got none. Ha ha ha! Hang on a minute. Yeah, get your nail in. It's probably not on a diet, isn't it? It's a food supplement, not bulk up calorie stuff. What about if we get in it? So I'll deliver a little stock. Should use my hair to open it. <laughs> <laughs> little star. Come on then. Jelly. I mean, they're not. But I can't stand anything that's too jelly. She look like she look like Aribos. I'm not a fan of sweeties. As people will know, I am definitely more a chocolate person. <laughs> We're nuts! But I'm not saying anymore. Because it'll ruin my day. I'm just going to double check. Just to see in case I have had one. Otherwise, we've got to act a bit like... We don't know what we're talking about. Yeah, but we do that every time. But this time we'll really be lost. Look at her peeking in the box. Get off. Now I'm hoping they fixed all the bug bearing competition time. No, I don't want any competition. Look at my bum. Order confirmation. No? No. I'll be with it. Let me have a look. I might have got it and not read it. I've got a missed call. 
just don't look popular. It was no. an Uber. Oh, what's this? A sneak peek kind of day. Yeah, well, no, that's where they show you three. They've now started showing us oh. three things before we get our parcel. So we did know. They don't send no post. No. And the sneak peek doesn't really tell you much about the products. Do you know what I mean? It's not like. I don't like the sneak peek. But last time, if you remember as well, although they did send a pink post, the, the way they're doing the pink post by email now, they've suddenly changed because they don't show tell you the price of things, do they? No. So I had to sit there for about three weeks with my pen and paper yeah, doing we'll research because all they have now is a description, when you do get one, a description of the product and buy now. And when you click on it, because a lot of products are new to the UK or whatever, you could end up all over the world trying to buy something in Abu Dhabi dollars and then having to uh, convert it into what it would be in British pounds. <coughs> so I don't like that because you can't work out... It, well, you can, I did. Yeah, but, but they'll send you, they, they gladly send you an email telling you how much it's worth, but don't tell you how they've worked it at. And then they'll like, gladly tell you that Glossy Box and Birch Box are both worth so much money too. Yeah, yeah, they're I mean, doing a comparison now between yeah. three boxes um, to show that you're getting good value with a uh, pink parcel box. But last time when I worked it out, there were cheaper ways of purchasing it than they'd, they'd added up, like, well, like all shops do, they'd added up the most expensive way of purchasing the items, whereas I looked at both. The general price and, and also bargain on seeing what you can get actually get it for. Have you found anything yet? No, but I'm going to try something. Just keep talking. Da, 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 da. Oh, I just understand these people. I'm so sorry. Every week we say we're going to be professional. Does <laughs> it happen? No. no. My dog's my dog's already made a very strange noise. Then she's parted and made a render spell. We tried to talk through. My child has not been murdered. He is, he is in bed. He's poorly sick, my little bear. And we've not we've turned the television off. So we don't get any interruptions. So I'm hoping that it won't set itself back on again, like it normally does in the middle of our videos. So yes, this month Got it. Are you doing reading then? No. Me no. I haven't got it. It's just telling us the list of what it is. Yeah, precisely. <sighs> Sorry, people. That's a bit crap pink parcel. I mean, come on. Yeah, but as well, some things, especially when they send us these lovely random things that we do, we've never come across and nobody in the world ever has, like them bloody iron supplements we tried last time. Mm. We need instructions about how to use them, because sometimes, because they're a, a travel size or a miniature size, they don't have it on like they probably would do on a full-size product. So, you know what I mean? We do look forward to that. We do like to know what we're getting. So, we're going to go back, you're all bored to death now, you've had a, a synopsis of boringness, to the once box. Da -da 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 -da. So, she will hopefully get some hair vitamins because she's had them on, aren't you, to them? So, I have got... I end up with a half price box. We have got the vitamins, but we have both got... Uh, a Toucan. notebook. Toucan notebook. So, that's two items in itself. Right then, have we got anything that we've got separately? No, nope. right, exactly. Oh, that's another fit. Why have she got this? I'm not. I am. I really get left out all the time, me. They know I'm nice. Now, shall we go to the obligatory, what we always get first? Get it out of the way. Tea bag. Tea bag. So, what's this one? Sleep breezy. Chamomile and peach tea. Oh, I might have a gallon of this. Chamomile and peach. I can't do it. Have you ever... Oh, mm. Well, we'll sh we shall see. So, we all get a tea bag. So, that's three things so far. And chocolate. Now then. Treat. Pretty parcel. Wait a minute. As a chocolate person, you normally send us this dire inedible... I'm looking forward to this. Bitter nasty. With added flavour of feet and things. Chocolate bars, don't they? Yeah. Which promise a lot, but actually all the taste are bitter and quite nasty. And all your vegans out there that can't have it, can I have it? 
It's a chocolate. Get a grip. So, as I was saying, pink parcel. Thank you so much. We have actually got something that is actually sweet. Milk chocolate. The luxury. Mm -hmm. Now, this is the kind of thing... A marshmallow, marshmallow wrapped in chocolate. Chocolate wrapped marshmallow by Baru, whoever they are. Now, this is what a girl wants. Oh. Don't open it yet. I'm not opening it. I'm reading the instructions. It's edible to be in seats in it. Did you see what happened to me popcorn that time? Yeah. <laughs> and me thing. Me Ooh. nuts and... Oh, yeah. Oh, that oh me. I know you did. I never got a sifter. Well, all I know is it's got natural ingredients in it. Well, there you go. So, thank you very much. Made in Belgium. We'll be trying, testing that in a minute with our cup of tea. And I'm actually quite looking forward to that. Me and all. Unless they've done something dire, it should should be edible. Thank you, Pink Parcel. We want period girls need sweetie things to cheer ourselves up and feel better. Now, what are we getting now? Laritze. Laritze. Mm. Liquid beam. Multi-purpose liquid illuminator. Okay. Oh, what colour have you got? I've got pearl. I've got quartz. Ooh. So I'll put them up. Now, other Loritzy products that I've had, like the lipstick and things, I've been really good. I've been really impressed with them. Ooh, nice. Man's like a veggie rose. Look at that, baby. Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh, ooh I've got ooh, liquid ooh. beam. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So I've got this colour. Mmm. Ready? Shine bright like a diamond. Where are we going first? Cheek on. And down the clunk. Oh yeah, well, shiny, shiny. Oh, Zulu warrior, they. Dear, that's very rare. Uh, I've got a glow. Well, again, when one's on one's uh, lovely time of the month, one needs the extra, extra glow because we feel like we've been murdered. Happy with that? What do you think? I like that. I like it a lot. Long time. Thank you very much. But we'll, we'll see. If you put it on over foundation, it might do that finger. Yeah. Well, I have. Oh. Well, how did you know we didn't have what we in box then? What? I've already got foundation on. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> da, da, da. Get back to Airy Boy, you. Oh. Hey, what? What? <laughs> Are you with me now? <laughs> Is there anybody in? No. No. Like that. It's upside down. <laughs> Anyway, it's just beyond our rope, innit? Shut up. I've got a posh little box in mine, have you? I have a posh little box in mine. Ooh la Ooh, la. I'm going to show them that first. Oh. Let's get rid of that first. Because yeah, I'm looking forward to this. For all you piss heads out there. Uh, for all you people who like to partake of a little wine. Why not? These are wine inspired hair masks. Hair masks. Because wine has a lot of antioxidants in it's quite good for you and definitely good for your hair. So it's called. <laughs> Here we go. I'm Let's not see. even going to do well, it. Well, do your special one. Pinot? Who? <laughs> no! Go on, do another Airy Moore. No, we I need can't. one. Cheer me up. I didn't mean to do Airy Moore, so oh, that's that quite funny. With the oorah. <laughs> Don't because I want to say pie not. It's a good job you did it then. You didn't go eat shopping ass for it. <laughs> <laughs> the lady in Debenhams would be a little bit confused. I didn't go to the perfume shop in a second, I have the... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> him. The just, just give me a... Him who makes alien. <laughs> <laughs> so, what have we got, darling? Do tell me. It's a wine. It is a wine. Mm -hmm. I can't say that name. I've just done it. Pinot Noir. Oh, I did say it right. So. So we've got repair and moisture. Deep conditioner. Mmm. Infused with wine. <laughs> Pomegranate and plum extracts. 
to help smooth and moisturise damaged hair. Yes. Go so, on, you do the instructions then. For this happen, so take control with this luxury... Luxur luxurious is the word you're looking for. I am. Oh, it's got drying alcohol. Get on with it. Can you carry on reading? Sorry. For people. Luxurious. And the Pinot inspired deep conditioner with wine extract wine extract packed with antioxidants to help rejuvenate and strengthen and soften body blah it's also got grapeseed oil which is rich in vitamin e and it smooths your cute air cuticles and prevents fizz pomegranate extract full of antioxidants and it helps res restore damaged hair and plum extract mm. rich in nutrients helping in a main in helping to maintain healthy strands you want to read what it does? Go on. Oh, me. Yeah, I'm enjoying this now. <laughs> Directions. After shampooing, apply to wet hair and leave in for up to five minutes. Rinse thoroughly. Uh, rinse thoroughly. <laughs> thoroughly. Thoroughly. Can't help being northern. Use one to two times <laughs> per week or as needed. <laughs> Caution. This is not food uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh. or drink. So do not Don't consume eat it. it. So, but if you've got a problem with alcohol, you might not. Yeah, that's got drying alcohol in it. So, what is that that kind of stuff? We've got quite a lot in there as well, haven't we? Yeah, it's a, yeah, it's a quite a fat pouch that. Yeah, I'm gonna give that a go. Very nice. Quite like it. I don't mind. I'm looking at this now, we've already got one mask in the box. Thank you very much. I don't <laughs> like it when we get three masks and nothing else, and it's pink. It's a lousy tea bag. So yes. You put it out on your head if it were pink, will not you? Yeah. Do you know? I ain't even got pink strings right. in my box. Mm, mm, mm. Now, this is what I'm, I'm going to practice to be. Meow. Oh. That was the star of the show and you've gone with that first. You said do that last. No, I didn't. I said do the other one, get rid of it. Oh. <laughs> no, what I mean. This is a new thing from Pink Parcel. We've never had one of these before, so don't any of you out there that do subscription boxes on Pink Parcel say that you've had one because you haven't. Have they? No. You take it offence. It's people. It's true. true. Now, I'm just saying, I'm loving my little box. It's very posh looking like it. Now, it's actually a bath <laughs> melt. What's a melt? Miss Patisserie. And we've both got rose. It stinks. Now it does smell of rose. Now I do not like rose. I don't like rose and I won't be using it. Hold on. But look at that little pretty cupcake. And it does smell. Rosa. Look at that. It, it is beautiful. beautiful. They are good. <clears throat> now for a gift. That's nice. And it, oh, if you loved rose, well, you were aware there. It's, it's absolutely amazing. But the little box as well. Yeah. The whole thing is a real treat and beautiful. If it was a different flavour. Yep. I'd Which they do up. because we have looked it up. Yeah, some people have got a lovely. Because what happened with this, we knew that this was coming because that's the three things that they picked to tell you that was coming. Yeah, we did get a sneak peek. You, like I said, they've started doing a sneak peek before you get your box. And they've done one for next month. So we've been very really excited about this box because of this. Yeah, but it was a of two choices and I prayed I wouldn't get the rose because I don't I really don't like rose. The other one was lavender though weren't it? No it was a lovely aqua green one it was. See and it really is. Rosa. Very rose. I mean like some perfumes will say the rose but. Right then so it says here this handmade bath melt is made with nourishing cocoa. Cocoa. And shea, but shea butter. Shea butter. To help soften and moisture the skin. All of our products are cruelty free, vegan friendly. And that's at Miss Patisserie at. Oh, www. Miss. Patisserie. Yeah, line. Patisserie.com. It's a com. Line. Yep. Honest, honest vegan skincare. And it says you can read the directions. Yeah, she might like item. Right, so directions. Peel off the paper wrapper. I presume that's like the cupcake one at the bottom. And discard the flour before use. Why? I want to keep flour in me. I would. <laughs> I'm not bothered if the flour was up my bum. Pop the melt into a warm bath and enjoy. Tip. Use the melt over several baths by taking it out of the bath 
and placing it on a soap dish for next time. Caution, do not eat it. Yeah, but I suppose keep out of each children, so children might think that actually is a little geek. Till the bath into it. It won't taste very nice, especially yeah. in rows. Okay, this so the star of the show. So far, well, I like it. We've, we, we're doing very well. I mean, and we've actually had some new products that we've never had before. Now, <coughs> you say star of the show, I'm not quite keen, but I appreciate what it is and the value. I meant for them, it's the star of the show, isn't it? Well, the Luizzi and this. It is made by Alison Cougar. <laughs> Cougar. I'm not really. I haven't got the energy. Living up. And Who's going to get it out because they're both same? Yeah. It says six shades of nude. Ooh la la. Get it, get it. Contains six beautiful shimmer eyeshadows to create a combination of glamorous and dazzling eyeshadow looks. Apply <coughs> desired shade using an eyeshadow brush. Colours can, can be blended, blended to suit your mood and look. look. Oh, yeah, so oh, I didn't know! Look at that! That's far clear. It's a buffer paper. God help us. Irri oh, I would there. say it's iridescent. Right. Mm. Okay, shut up. Okay. Oh, it's bipolar done. Thank you, pardon. What's the name? Cougar. That sounded like bipolar. <laughs> Did it? Yeah. Uh, so, no. <laughs> no. This is by Paula <laughs> Dunn. <laughs> Just thought we ought to clarify that. <laughs> you don't know before, what I mean. Yeah, I know. Before we have these special moments if we get people abusing us, because we seriously... Do you know what? It serious. used to be a point where I was very professional and very highly educated. It was a dumb with ear that it would play up to the camera. So it looked. Now I've just got all of, all of a sudden... No. Gormless. This is what happened. <laughs> this is real life. This is real life. Right? This is no... As you can tell, we don't do now, do we? Right? We don't edit it, we don't cut it, we no. don't do now. This is like one continual chunner <laughs> of drivel. But over time, obviously, Madam's relaxed. To the point that you now see exactly what I have to live with. <laughs> right, let's show them. So it's a, it's a nude. Uh, yeah. There we go. So they are buildable and blendable. I do remember that from that. Uh, what we're doing? Behind. Behind. Oh. Right. There we go. Are we not going to swatch it? Okay. She's looking at how many fingers she's going to need here. You're going to need an extra one. <laughs> oh, I like that finger. Okay. Right. There we go. Do you know, if you walked into some department store and you were highlighting a new product of eyeshadow, and the woman benefit what let me show you these colours and she shows you lovely on her fingers which you like that on your face and then she just <laughs> uh, what do you think now there you go yeah you, you'd think that okay then it's the least eyeshadow then special. right so which one would you think would suit my complexion no it depends doesn't it because it's eyeshadow yeah go on I like that one <laughs> I like this one yeah I knew you would see I can't wear that I look like I've been smacked in eye now, the gold, gold looks good on me. So, I, the lighter shades, lighter three, and the dark shade you would use to define. Unless you're holly, so then you just put it on. Mm. Wish you washer. Let's put the brown on. Oh, looks like mud. It's not wishy washy. I'm just going in now. Please with, um, don't apply your eyeshadows in this way at all. Do not try this at all. I don't have a brush. 
That's not bad. It's, it's just not. It's not my colour though. May I just say? Yeah. When you being f- any kind of filming mm. cameras, obviously, as we all know, even men they have to put makeup on because otherwise they look washed out, don't yes. they? Yeah. Because it tends to blend colours. They're actually a lot stronger in real life. I'm talking sense here. I look like a good that pit. They look in real life stronger, and and the colour pigmentation is stronger than it does on camera. Now she looks like Aya Wather who's had a bad day. <laughs> Boo! Well, at least you know it's good for contouring. <laughs> Apart from the fact it's for your eyes and it's eyeshadow. Well, you never know if you get caught short. But there's always one, and there she is. Very nice product. Ooh, what is this? Yes. Yeah, so again, that's a good size. I mean, it's a full sized product. You know, there's quite a few full size products in here. It is good value. And it is what ladies will use. Mm. And it's pretty. It is. So, and when you add up now, so we've got, in recent months, we've had about, we've had five items, haven't we? Yeah. So when you put in hours, we've got three. The tea bag, the chocolate, the hair mask. So that's three. The Luritzi highlighter, that's four. The Cougar set, I should have said, that's five. Six with the beautiful bath bomb. And then seven. Seven with a notebook and eight with the vitamins. So I am highly delighted. This has been a good box, except it's you didn't send me no vitamins and I didn't get no pink fluff in my box. So I'm not, I'm, I'm already marked you down for that. In. I don't give a shit. Do you know? Dominic, you said you were packing everybody's box individually. Why haven't you packed mine correctly? It's always me. You always get an email from me. I'm sure that they'll like my emails. No, they don't like you. That's the trouble. Well, get it right then. You'll never hear from me again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there is that. Job. Dominic, give yourself a break, love. Now, if I had to do one small thing, right, to get rid of her, I'd do it, man. Trouble is, she keeps coming back. Like a boomerang. Yeah, from hell. Oh, like a, a ball off. Because now you all can see, now that this professional's actually showing her true side, her dark side, the dark lord what I have to put up with while I'm on a period. Don't, don't take it like this. Yeah, Dominic, can I have something extra? Because I need something extra. Maybe that's why he's sending me something extra, because he, he knows what I have to put up with. What? Maybe Funnily it's... enough, he's come to your house and delivered it, because we don't know how yours has got here. At me and Dominic. Mm. So, yes, I'm delighted that we've got all our sanitary products. One small thing. I think the brown box is a bit burnt. Yeah, I don't like that. You, you know, know what? Do you know what you, you know what it, Let me ex- no, hold on a minute because I'm missing the trick. What's the name of it? So why is it not pink? That box should be pink. The thing is, my point with the box is, us ladies, as we say, are a bit miserable as sin. Pre, during, and after. This box you've created. To cheer us all up during that sad, sad emotional time that we have to put up with for blooming once every <laughs> four weeks. With me, even longer. Where we look like an Easter egg and we feel even worse. Now, that to me doesn't say... Cheer me up when I'm on a period. This is a luxury product you're going to enjoy opening this. Now, I did when I opened it. Oh, Yeah. No, See, I've never had a problem with them boxes because it, I like them. She doesn't. Um, but I, mean, I don't. Well, they're all right. They're the pink. Classy. It's pink. But I loved the white ones. Yeah, I did. I a that, one with a pink. Well, right. very, very classy. And it was like a little treat and luxury to open it up. But yeah, yeah. I mean, to say you've gone to the trouble of having pink parcel embossed onto the lids. And we know it's yeah. not to save your packaging <laughs> or your money or your costing or the fact that vegans are there. Because it can be done. Because they've done it. It's pink. Even if the outside box... Yeah, but we're not going to advertise somebody else, are we? All right. 
just the pink bit there. Right? So even if the outside box is pink. Or... Do you advertise it again? I'm not. Put a little leaflet thing round it. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, it, it's just one point. I mean, if we stick with this and the products remain as good and as varied, then fair dues, I'm not bothered. I'm not bothered. But can I make a little request? If I may. And you're going to agree with me here. Ooh. So put your face straight. Right. You know when we have anything that's a flavour? Tell me why it's always rose. Yeah, because you know when you think about it, right? You're not you're not targeting your periods at old women because they don't have them. Well, this is it. So, it's just a request, please, because we, we tend to get anything that does is smelly, will be rose. And you know what's coming up next? Ladies in lavender and lily of the valley. Yeah, the scent of the lily of the valley, hardly. I mean, bless. My grandma was 86. She died many, 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 many moons ago. People, I was 16 when she died. She was 86 and she used Yardley, Lily of the Valley. People that go in Atkinson's. Other the, shops are available. No, they're not because we are... Other department stores that sell it are available, I have to say. Yeah, right. People that go in that shop haven't seen a period for years. They've it, passed it. I have to say, Yard, it, it, it's a very old-fashioned brand and, and smell. I mean, if, if Yardley had come out with a new one... But it's, that's been out since time began. We're calling all um, fans out here now. And the flavour of that, you either get Rose, again, or Lily of the Valley. I mean, oh, I but guess which one we're going to get? We're going to get Rose. No. I'd rather, I've never smelt Lily of the Valley, Dominic, so make sure you put that in mind, please. Got an elderly lady on our street. We're going to do spray when she walks <laughs> past. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hope you're not talking about me. Oh, might be. No, but... You know what I mean? I like the idea that you've put perfumes in. I like a bit of perfume. You know what I mean? Even if it's one I don't like. Could I put Airy Moore in? Yeah. Well, they'd have to find that first, haven't they? You've probably totally confused them. They probably look for Ura on the Airy Moore and they can't find it, surprisingly enough. Oh. But you know, so, yeah, perfumes, but try and keep them a bit more modern. Mm. And please, my request was, can we have a different flavour from those, please? I mean, yes, it's like tea bags. Some people love tea bags, and we have to lump a tea bag, don't we? And some people will love rose and think it's the most beautiful flavour of smell in the world. Shut your face, you. But what happens if you don't? If you do, if you're doing nothing but and things that smell of rose, and people don't like rose. I don't like rose. You know, you have to cater for the masses. So can we mix it up a bit? One in three rows and the other two are surprise. Yeah. You know what I mean? So there's just that, but I must say, the value of the box, the contents of the box, hurrah. Because me and her, in a minute, will have to do a taste test. I don't think the tea's going to be knocking a point off anyway, right? But well, we used to, t I mean, fair dues, we lump the tea. Yeah. So I found out of this box, neither one of us used the dailies ever, right? For what they're meant to be. I'd use them for taking off nail varnish. Well, there you go, right? Both of us hate tea, so that's two things. But we, we've got used to that, and regardless of that, it's the other contents of the box that we look forward to, isn't yeah. it? So with those other things, please, can we have a bit of a mix-up of smells and shades sometimes? Because we do tend to get very same shades, don't we? All right, let me get it at all. And we've had a lot of highlighters. Oh, yeah. <laughs> which are all very nice. But how many highlighters does a unicorn need? Just, I know she likes to cover herself in it. Do you know what I mean? So, again, can we have it like where every month it's a different thing and then another highlighter? You know what I mean? Split them up a bit. Instead of like month after month of the same product. Mm -hmm. okay. You've already... You, no. you already have put an email out saying about what we would like to see. And it's a competition. Therefore, if we mention what we would like to see in the box in the future, we could get a year's supply of pink parcel. Is that right? Mm-hmm. Right. Guys. No, because, but we won't stay on here because... No, we're not. Asking, we're asking for brands. Yeah, obviously we're not brands. We're not, we're not allowed to drop it. But um, what I am going to say, if mm -hmm. these you guys that watch it, because I know you're out there, because I get approached by you men. 
of all people, watched my video about periods. But they are women's <laughs> products that we're asking about. We yeah. don't want who I want some men. Links. You put chocolate products here. I want some shaving foam and a balm. You know what I mean? Unless it's for ladies' legs. It ain't happening. Or a nail or an hammer. So, yes, we're actually looking for brands and types of things. Ideas. And we will put them forward. So, what we think we're going to do is, on one... Because, obviously, we're going to combine. we separately. We get... But combined together, if you know what I mean. She gets an email. I get an email. So, we we're going to go and look through what you say and send it on one. And then we will think together on the second one. Do you know what I mean? always have to make everything bloody complicated. Well, just let them know. Don't matter how we'll let them know. I'm going to assure you, should you send us any ideas that your ladies, if you have a lady who's listening, or you're a man who has a lady, or a sister or a mother or whatever, who has to go through the atrocities Or you are just like our videos. What would you like <coughs> to see off Pink Parcel? Uh, and for all you lovely people, I'm sure you won't do it, but no setting us up. Because if we, if we sense that we're going to be set up for... Taste testing. I think help. we're on a winner anyway with what oh, we've oh, said. Mm. You've said it now, haven't you? If I get one of them shakes next month, you're eating it. <laughs> you have mentioned it. Because I haven't gone over it. Why have I said it? You said it. Because. You went, oh, you've said it now. You said, and you said they're going to set it up. <coughs> set yeah. us up. I was on about we're going to win what we're going to set. Because I think it's a good idea. Can't say that's whether they can get a hold of it. Isn't it? Well, somebody else. It's where the pink problem. parcel thinks it's profitable enough and and it, well, it really is feasible to do. So anyway, it's the tea test. Can we have the chocolate first? Oh yeah. I knew she wants to know to that. Have you seen this? She can unwrap a wrapper in the dark with her hands tied behind her back faster than any. Do you know what I'm not though? I don't like Belgian chocolate, so that's the only thing I'm not looking forward to. I'll tell you what. It's got a marshmallow in it. Go I've, I've got one of them them dark chocolate no. bars. You keep, it, no. Don't you have no. that. No, let's not have a test. Oh. <laughs> I hope you're choking it now, Liz. <laughs> you see that? See, it says this. Mm. It's kept her quiet. She can't talk, though, can you? No. Mine doesn't look like that. Mine must mash. <laughs> Dominic don't like me. It's a blood... Does it taste any different when it's in your mouth? I don't know. Well, you put the whole thing in, so you should know. Mm. That'd be nice, that. Mm. I wonder how much they are. I'll have a look while you're chomping. Baru B. Come up straight away. Our treat. Kate chocolate marshmallow and bars. Oh, it sounds a bit like Willy Wonka factory, doesn't it? Scrum dilly luncheous. Right, go on then. Tell me how much it is. Shop. Mm. <laughs> 35 euro <coughs> they're not 35 euro 9 pieces of the cho milk chocolate marshmallows 6 euro 45p 10 <laughs> 45 p then. look at that one 2 dreamy hippos oh but they're dark chocolate and sea salt we're on finger parcel this is what a lady wants. That would de that cheer up. I'm clear chocolate when I'm on my period. Mm. That I would eat because that's just the right amount. I don't mm. have a lot of chocolate. She will, but I don't. I don't. Not in one go. I don't. Take my time. Spend if it's good, <coughs> isn't it? Yeah, we know, but I only have one hook. One. Well, I don't. I used to have one wo walnut whip at a time. They're not very big enough. They're even smaller now, they haven't got the nuts on. <laughs> I enjoyed that, nice. If you wonder why we are doing this... Because we've got to cleanse our palate. So we can tell you what how disgusting the tea is or not. 
I'm not looking forward to peach and chamomile. Oh yes, I was just about to say what, what flavour is it again? But the other one was something rank and right. it only tasted a tea. Before we look at it, close your eyes. Because he's got a neat sleep mask on. Breathe. Oh, it does, doesn't it? I can smell a bit of feature. <coughs> oh, we've got a weird shape bag. It's a rocket bag. Rocket bin! Just getting David Bowie on the case. Oh. Mm. Jing's got something bad going on. You have to be careful not to rip bag, don't you? Yeah, because it's a plastic bag. Yeah, we're not, yeah, but it's only a light mesh. Oh, it's pyramid. Mm. Oh. Pyramid bag. Pyramid for periods. That looks like some kind of... <clears throat> Walk like an Egyptian. Looks like something you put in a birdcage. No, it doesn't. It looks like something you'd get done for. In possession of. <coughs> I wouldn't know if I was classic that. Do you not watch programmes? I don't actually study the, the drugs that they're talking about on the television. It's got croutons in it again. What's the crouton? Bread. Yeah, last time we had one, it looked like it had croutons in it. Right, folks. So let's just see if you agree. <laughs> How many croutons can you see in that? There. Oh, you know, but, you know right, when you have... That, which is why I said bird kit. Let me look, I can't see. Croutons, people. Croutons. Oh, it does look birdy. I love what kettle on. It's poking out of its... Wow. I beg your pardon. Looks like hay. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Adam, can I? Oh, it's a bit stinky. That's peach, that. Look, well, does look like you'd feed it to your rabbit. Hey, so... What? Why has it took us quite a while to, to do our pink parcel? Because we're waiting for your box. No. Hey, not only that, it weren't that. I can't remember why. You went on an order, didn't you? Left me. Oh, I did. And your box still had come back time I'd come back. It made no odds. <coughs> yeah. Well, here we go. Now you're going to take piss out of me because of me on the Where did she go? To the middle of nowhere. Saint-Lemire. French. No, it sounds French, doesn't it? It does sound... South of France. I went to oh, Hull. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> on the coast of Hull, weren't it? On the coast, on the airy moor. Yeah, well, no, no. We haven't found the airy moor yet. I really don't want to go there either. We might oh. get an aura. And you had the aura. So, yes, with our lovely weather, as you know, people, we your special wet wellies on your daddy bought, yeah? Mm -hmm. And what did you do on your... <laughs> Absolutely, fuck all. And I'll translate. Not very much. They weren't know what to do. Yeah, but come on, what did you do? No, because you're taking the piss. What did you want to do? Hartree. Hartree with a H! Right? So, but but there were only two people who volunteered for Hartree, weren't there? And yeah. That were you and your man. Yeah. yeah. So I said, and then he come and tell, says to us, oh, you're doing Hartree, yeah. All right, then. There's only your two that's done it. I was asked if you wouldn't do it. Give me half an hour, I'll set it up. So I said, don't bother. There weren't no horses to go horse riding. October green. <laughs> went to the... You said in a log cabin. Yeah. But it went to the shortest town in the world. And it was right for now. I'm gonna, have to do, I'm gonna have to name drop now. So other shops are available. So I went to this this town, this seaside town, right, four miles away. And on this thing, I think you know some some exciting's gonna happen. Four mi miles from where they were staying, yeah. not from here. Right. So <laughs> walking down, and they were pub, obligatory, charity shop. They're everywhere. Bakers. Ooh, not bad. Which was Coupland's. Other bakeries are available. <coughs> Pub. Obligatory. Hardware store. Well, if you're stuck in the middle of nowhere, you might need a screw. Jack Fulton's. 
Uh, Other superstore. <laughs> not available. It weren't a superstore, it's a freezer store. Charity shop. Other charity shops are available. Card shop that fixed watch batteries. Well, they've got to be multifunctional in the country, haven't they? And the end, or post office, which was shut, and then another pub, and next to the pub at the end. Yes. In this nice, historic seaside town that's not been touched for years because nobody knows where it is, therefore they have no funding to do it up, was Aldi. <laughs> They're everywhere. Aldi. Other grocery shops are available. I just couldn't believe it. Well, at least you could buy something in Aldi. Yeah. But it just looked funny. So you can get drunk. Mm-hmm. You can do a cheap shop. Oh, Mr. Cafe. They had a nice Alice in Wonderland cafe. Yeah. Not right, but it was short. <laughs> <laughs> I think they're having their afternoon CS. So, so what else did you do? No. You did. Argued. Yeah, but you can argue on your own in an empty room. That's now new. That's it. All went to hold the day uh, for one day. Excuse me. What? What did you do for me? Oh! <laughs> People that don't know me, which you will not, right? They've got a gist. This channel was officially set up for me and my pen pals abroad to see how I live my life here. <laughs> Is that the signal for abroad? Right. And obviously I've kept it going and then we've decided to do this. So, I am a pen paler. And this moron, who, pro- who pretends that she's not going to miss me, right? Spent all week saying to me, I'm going to be on me own. I'm not going to know what I'm going to do. It would be fucking quiet without you, right? And she said, tell you what you'll have to do. You'll have to write to me. No, why did I mention that? Because somebody was already mourning because the weather was atrocious. And oh, she yeah. actually looked at where she booked to go for this week. And realised that her log cabin was in the middle of nowhere. And I mean miles from I had no signal. Anywhere. Nowhere. And you know what else? I think You never get this. All those what's, what's holidayed abroad, right, who have caravans, you will know that in that caravan or holiday house or whatever on the coast, it is the law... Even growing up in your era and my era and everybody hey, else, you know, even yeah. now, it is the law when you have a caravan or a holiday house. Yes, go on. You have to have cards and dominoes. It's a shit game and nobody ever plays it. You take the piss out of each other because you're going to go, oh, it's going to piss it down, let's get cards out. I didn't even have them. Shh. We didn't have them. So, both channels on telly because... Somebody was complaining that she didn't want to go because she'd have nothing to do. Yeah. She'd be trapped in this log cabin with it chucking it down persistently with nothing and no one all alone. Apart from her young man who probably would zoom off fishing, quite happy with his lake. So I said, since she likes writing letters, she can write one to me. I did. And she did. I don't know how she got it because I had to go to the, the post office that no sees nobody there. It's like the local people, right? And then it said... The it's post not for office, sheep, is it? The post office is closed for, what were it, book balancing when they have no one coming. <laughs> They've got nobody there. No one's there. Nobody's going to be posting letters apart from here. So I made the man post it. Yeah. See? She was that bored, she had to write pen pal letters to her friends that she was going to see in a couple of days anyway. Did you know that a stamp costs her 70 pence this day, these days? I do it. I was scandalous, didn't I? I know, I remember it was 36 Excuse me, all the old royal mail are there. You're taking the proverbial. Mm. Man, yet, see, they're trying to make the money back because we, everybody used to send letters. Yeah. Now we press a button on the like, phone, tablet, computer. Laptop. Anyway, that was the intro interval of our tea making, which we need to dip the tea in the bag. Uh, yeah. I shall get the clear cup. Clear cup. Because you like to look at the. Because you like to see what we're being tortured by. I'm not looking forward to this one. I bet it tastes like tea again. Because they, they talk a big game, these off black people. Tea bags. 
the last one, you couldn't taste no but tea. She's done it again. I'm doing king. Oh, hang on a minute, I'm just get it in. Oh, it's changed colour straight away. Looks like pond water. You <laughs> look like a pond. <laughs> put a couple of fish in there and I've done. Looks like when you grow, grow crest, doesn't it? Yeah, we normally start growing that on I mean, wet kitchen paper. Oh, no, I don't mean that. What I mean is that, that potato head that grows grass hair. <laughs> crest head. You don't know what I mean, do you? Yeah, I do. It's like some kind of sawdust in a, in a, in a tight. Right, I'm just going to stick it in the other cup. I'm not having weak tea. Oh, like well, it's not going to turn into, I mean, builder's tea, is it, this? Oh, I lost my dingle dangle. She's very rude today. I'll behave yourself. Concentrating. Right, so that's the colour we've now got. Pond. Pond life. <laughs> <laughs> Having a laugh, pig parcel. That don't look very appetising. This is the smell. Do you know, this is what gets me right about fruit teas. This is what I don't understand with, with, with these tea drinkers. Because I, I have literally been through and tried them all. Determined I would find one. Gosh, you've not put any cold water in. I can't drink that. Blow on it, you big No, boss. it takes forever. So, what I was always saying, is it me? Why do fruit teas, fruit-infused fruit teas, why, when you smell them, they smell quite nice. They smell like a... You know it's not going to taste nice. You know when you used to have cordial, cordial as a kid in winter? To warm your belly up. Well, why that was so important, I do not know, but it used to yeah, be a big thing. Yeah, hot Ribena. Yeah. See, I was trying to avoid the brands. You mean Because I didn't have Ribena, I had the other one. Vimto. Do you know what I'm wasting my time? Other cordials are available by many different... Producers. Well, you try having a hot juicy. Thank you, man. You wouldn't drink juicy. I've had a hot. Uh... Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> In the jungle. That one. You went to the jungle? No. <laughs> On Bongo? Yes. Oh. Is it? I thought that were already diluted. The key. Oh. It used to be the advert. Kiora. Oh, but do you know what I mean? Oh, the cardio manufacturers are available. You'd have hot Ribena, hot Bimto and hot, hot, hot Kiora, but you wouldn't have a hot Juicy from fucking Happy Shopper, would you? So why not brand drop? Because that's already diluted squash. No, I'm on about the cheap things that's like 29 pence for some dilute pop that you have to dilute yourself, which tastes like piss. I'm so sorry the manufacturers of Juicy. I'm sure it's a beautiful <laughs> brand and some people must really like it. Right. I'm sorry for any offence to anybody who really enjoys that product. And they sell it as So please. Do you know what? I'm wasting my time and my life. All I do is apologise for thee. But you won't though, would you? No, but why did it... As I was saying, Jesus. We'll get them in the end. I'm sorry if that's only sacral. I just do not mean to be. There you go. If you believe in everything, that's wonderful. Love you. Right. So. <laughs> so. And yes, I am a Catholic, so we can do that. So. Yeah. As I was saying, why do they smell like that a fruity drink? Like they do now. Right, all of them they smell quite nice. You think, mm, I'm gonna, this is it, it's gonna be quite sweet, quite nice. Mm -mm -mm. And then you taste it, it tastes nothing like what it smells like. No, because you know the apple and black currant sings a good game. I'm like, at me, ow, that'll taste right nice. Apple yep. and black currant tea, uh, herbal tea, yep. And it's vile. Go on then. I've had them all. Right, look at my pond water. Oh. You look like you've got a bad kidney infection with that one. Oh no, it's, just, it's reflection off the top. Break on a minute! Oh! I'm so sorry! Oh, we've got a. Oh, 
there and it just goes, <laughs> woo, litter, target practice. <laughs> it's just smacked me. <laughs> Full on on the lips. <laughs> and up my nose. Every time, this is it. I put it in a certain position so it won't do that. Went in my eye last time. Matthew moves it. Don't. It really shot me a good didn't I one night we were on couch screaming. So yeah, it's one of them automatic air fresheners. But for some reason it keeps moving it. <laughs> <laughs> so we should try this one again. It does smell fruity, it doesn't it? It does smell fruit. It smells like peach. Ready? Here we go. Here we go. And that doesn't <laughs> That does not taste like tea. That tastes fucking horrible. <laughs> I will open for pond water. That's vile. It's like you've eaten a bath bomb. It's vile. It's vile. Like you, that look, that is like you drank your bath water. Yeah, you've had a bath bomb in your bath, and we're drinking it. <sighs> we're probably skin cells and everything else. That's it looks really like, like it though, doesn't it? Yeah, mucky bath water for people that look at eye green. It's yeah, rank. No, that's not nice. Because you get an horrible. That aftertaste. aftertaste won't go away. Where's my cold coffee? Come here, mate. Come here. No, I couldn't drink that. See, now, that other tea we had from them I, was supposed to be Earl Grey, and I can't stand And Rose. Yeah. The two things I ate in all the world put together. But all it tasted of and looked like was a cup of tea. And it tasted nice. -ish. And it was the same make as these. So I was assuming, in my fantasy land, that this one would be a similar sort of thing. But no. It's like, I don't understand. Why do people want to taste something that's tasteless but it's like you've put some perfume in your mouth with with just plain hot water yeah but we don't have What's sugar in it either why it might taste different if you put sugar in it oh, the whole point of, of herbal teas is, is you're telling me people don't put sugar in herbal tea well they, they don't do. put milk in it either do they <coughs> no they don't they have them straight oh, i don't, I, like don't I cannot understand the taste buds that you would need to have well, then that just defeats the object. What do you mean when it defeats the object? Because if people just have them straight, they're bitter, they're vile, they're disgusting. There's no, no sweet taste to them whatsoever. Therefore, again, when you're on your period, a cup of tea, what we yeah, would but make, no, would this, help. No, but this is to give you a peaceful sleep. It's all the things that they put in with the tea. Naked first before I fall asleep. <laughs> Insect. I mean, this is it. They're all caffeine... Free, they're all. That's the thing. So, so you're not having the caffeine that you'd have with normal tea, and you you're supposed to be having all the health benefits like the green tea and the chamomile and the peppermint, and so this one's supposed to be calming and soothing. It just makes me want to puke. Yeah, that that's going to be the worst. But I think I don't know. I I think. Do you not find some? Maybe it's me. Maybe it's us. No, it can't Some be. people must be really determined to be as healthy as they can. To the extent that they will drink what tastes like meal bath water to me. And it looks like piss. Do you know what I mean? Well, something looks like you've got a kidney infection or whatever. You don't want to be drinking that. Yeah, but if it tasted all right, it wouldn't matter what it looked like. But again, you see, so they don't put... They, they certainly you drink don't with your eyes. Drink. Well, no. The first thing you do is your nose. And I'm sorry. Your nose smells cordial. Yeah. A peach is like peach crap. cordial. And it, no fucking. It, it's like plain boiling water, but you've got some bath bomb, peach bath bomb in your mouth. <laughs> because it's not even sweet. No. It's not like you've eaten a peach. It's not even like you've had a peach sweetie or a peach anything. You've got some peach perfume in your mouth. 
and you've drank some plain with boiled water. I, I, I really don't get... I, my gob must work differently to everybody else's taste buds then. Well, not really, because I don't like it. Yeah, but it's like, you know, some people will eat, the, uh, eat drink these um, disgusting concoctions of smoothies. Now, some smoothies can be really, really nice. But, you know what I mean? Where it's kale and seaweed and mulching and lentils and something else. Or, and ca- is... or kale and passion fruit. <coughs> Why? I mean, I like I like a bit of kale. I like spinach. And this is it. But you don't want to drink it. But I'd rather have it on a plate and eat it than... I mean, but you can, with raspberries, blueberries, things like that, you can make quite... And back banana, you can make one without adding any sugar, a lovely smoothie. Yeah. Great. And they've got health benefits in. A lot of antioxidants in blueberries. But, but they're bad for your teeth. Depends how many you have. All fruit's bad for your teeth because of fruit acid. And you're going to get. So, yes, so. But, Why have we got floors? Some people do. That's what I mean, there's buggers in that. I mean, some people do, don't they? They do have them. And they'll drink something that looks literally like pond filth that you drag out of a pond. So yeah, can can anybody explain to me why my taste buds? Nobody can explain that to you. Yeah, but what? No, what I want to know is, you know, these that do have them, vegans. Who enjoy? Do you really, really enjoy? Them? Are you are you trying to be super, super good and healthy? I'm not taking the piss, but vegan people, ask them, ask them. They drink that because it's vegan friendly. No. no yeah, no. the can't put milk in it, and it's full of good stuff. Ask them why they so like it's coffee. It. You can have coffee and be a vegan. Yeah, I understand, but people do drink that when you're a vegan. No, they can have normal tea. They can have decaffeinated tea. They can have decaf coffee. They can have whatever they want and be a vegan. It's not about vegans, really. But what I'm saying is, are, are you the people who are, do you genuinely enjoy them? They won't drink them otherwise, would they? No, some people will drink them. Or do you do it to be healthy? Is your willpower to be healthy? stronger enough to where it might taste disgusting but you'll drink it anyway you know know, somebody said to me you could lose a stone eating marmite yeah i won't do it you know what you know cider vinegar i tried that trick but but now you all saw with that small bottle when we did have a a blast man that was that had something loopy in of mother which was mother mother (laughs) disgusting no right so and I did try it, and it was putrid, putrid to do. It didn't help one. The only thing it did was give me the worst stomach acid I've ever had in my entire oh, life. No proper reflux, not just heartburn. So, um, but that was a real battle of wills. But I mean, if somebody's got strong willpower, maybe maybe their desire to be as healthy as possible overrides the taste buds. That's another contradiction there. Because, you know, I, we, we, cider vinegar, I used to drink it. Obviously, you dial into it, right? Um, but with a straw. And put the straw in as... No, put the straw in as far back as yeah, the Yeah, because cup. of your teeth. No. One, it helps the teeth, but two, mainly, you avoid a lot of taste buds, therefore, on the front of your... Half of your tongue. Well, we just won't do it. <laughs> well... What's I'm, the point, then? If you're not going to drink something that you don't like because you want to lose weight, it's daft. Well, I was I was desperate to lose weight till I, I realised that I made myself so poorly that I'd rather be alive and happy, yeah. and maybe not as as because I the trouble was I used to without trying used to be lovely and slim all my life till my thyroid messed up and then I had to have my thyroid out and boom now I, I live on a juju bean and a rice cake and I still put weight on. But it was quite a shock when you've been used to being one size to get used to this is me now. Love yourself. So I did try the bash, but... But, so, yeah, genuinely, do you actually... Do you drink this and go, mmm, that's beautiful? Somebody must like it. I don't care. They must do. Yeah, I know. I mean, it's like some people love rose. 
don't they? Some people do. I mean, I know. understand where you're coming from, though. There will be people that will just drink it for health ba- uh, benefit of it. Well, I worked with a woman, and she she used to put have a green tea for her lunch every. That's all she had. A green tea. For that her is lunch the worst. Every day. And and because she was doing it, I thought I'll try it. You know, and be healthy. It's good for your skin and aging and all that stuff. Yeah, I'll try. And I actually said to her, like, how can, how do you actually like this? And she said, I don't. But it, but it detoxes my stomach and keeps my weight down. So does good at gin. Well, she did that and all. Well, they, that's your answer. <laughs> but Not tru- green tea. Yeah, well, this is it. She went to the gym and this is it. But the biggest uh, benefit that she ever had was because she went under the I mean, surgeon's knife every five minutes. Well... She only went to the gym after she's had liposuction. That's like having a shit butt and then going to have it sucked out. Well, that's what she did. Yeah. No, but she went to the gym afterwards too because obviously they said to stay that way. You've now got to behave yourself. But, yeah. Just overall? To... Overall what? Your box. Who's, who's putting an overall? Me, when I go to work. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Laugh a minute in this house. Right, anyway... Yes. What are you giving it? Nine. Nine. Oh, wait. Oh. Jury's out. 8.5. You're just doing the same with Callum now, aren't you? Keeping us all in the... Oh, hang on a minute. 8.5. Right. What's the 8.5? Why 8.5, then? Because you didn't pack my box with what I wanted, in it. The same as yours. Everything else, spot on. Are you referring to your missing product? Yeah. Or are you miss- also referring to the pink fluff I got And the pink fluff. Jesus. And I don't like the packaging, <coughs> so I took a point off. Mm. I mean, if that is to be as eco-friendly as possible, keeping it brown, not coating it with pink, then fair enough. But it's a bit... Those girls want cheering up. That's the whole point of it. We want cheering up. I like that box. Uh... Dominic did something right, apart from me. But I have to say... To get our seven products and um, eight products as well. Yes. And they're all... I mean, perhaps not when I was a tea bag. They're, yeah, they're we never bought the tea bag down because we just don't like it. We do it for your benefit. Yeah. But we, we keep trying them. Yeah. I mean, And we did actually like the last one. Well, I won't, I'm not stretching it a bit. No, but, but I mean, I, 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 I could drink the other 12 one. of them. We've, had, we've been doing this now. 12. This, oh, happy anniversary. Oh, hello. Uh, 12 pink parcels in. Where's my paper present? That's what this is. Oh, great, yes. We've got a present for doing a 12 okay. month anniversary. Thank you. Thank you. So, it's like my daughter's tea party in here. So, yeah, yeah, at a 12, take away the coffee bag because we didn't like that either. Oh, that was. I, I mean, Rape looked forward to that one, didn't we? I did. I love coffee, but that was rank. That was the one tea bag that we liked. And, and funnily enough, it's, the, it's <laughs> the, the flavour that we didn't like. Yeah. It was the one that we hit. Rose. Wow. Rose and Earl Grey together. I mean, we've had them with orange and or peppermint mint, and I thought, ooh, I had a cold at the time, and I thought, ooh, that peppermint one. I might actually appreciate that this time, because I can't really taste the tea's flavour, but the peppermint might Well, have. the one that I had when I had a cold, remember? Right. She said it stank the house out. I couldn't it. taste it. I didn't tell her at the time. I went, shall I make you special tea? She went, yeah, we well, can't taste anything. Nothing tastes of anything anyway. I thought, ooh, great. So uh, the one that we, well, if you look back on our videos, the one we both were puking and green, because we got it again later on. It was the that one. stank to high heaven. I managed to drink it when I had blue. <laughs> yeah. So, yes. Um, nine. Nine, yeah. Nine. You would have got a nine off me if I'd have got the same as what you got. Well, I mean, yeah, there's the box, but maybe, like I said, that's to be as eco-friendly as possible. Fair enough. But <clears throat> I'm going to make an analysis for that, so I'm sort of half a point. The other half a point off with me is the fact that for some reason my date of delivery has changed. Oh, yeah. And I'm getting a bit fed up because you can't change the day of your periods because they're on a 28-day cycle. Like, well, even less for me. What I would say to that, though, is contact them because they will change it because they did mine. They will now, but before previous to that, you were stuffed. Yeah, that's true. So that's the, the half a mark for that because I can change it and half a mark for the box because it's not very Mm. It's not very cheap. Or, if it's got to be a brown outer, give us a bit more colourful inside. Yeah. I like the pink bow on it. I like, we'll have more bath bombs, please. Definitely. 
and with that at least we've got a mix of products we've not got three face masks or two highlighters or or three face ma uh, three masks in one like a hair mask face mask and a well that's what we've had that's what i'm saying where we got yeah. three masks in one box where we did... yeah so i'm happy with the products thank you for the extra um and I, do you know what I miss? Yeah, what? The makeup brushes. Oh yeah, can we have some more of them, please? I do. We miss not them. that pink. Really, really no, not the fan brush. That weren't a nice brush at all. No. But the other ones have all been fab. So yeah, can we have some more brushes? And please, can we have? You did um perfumes, uh, and bag perfumes, English Guard wear it or something. Yeah. And I loved them all. Can I have something more like that? That's, again, I mean, that sounds quite old-fashioned, but it is an expensive perfume. Oh, no, no, they, they are nice. I end up giving all <coughs> mine to her. And they're not... Rather than... I mean, okay, we've got the art Do you really think that a young person like me wants to walk around wearing that? Excuse it's me. Smelling like the lily on Do the you really think... It's even worse when you get a bit older, because then it, it transforms you from the age you are to already your impenetrable age, and you're 72. What the fuck are they going to do with the people that have only just come well, to the Well, the are available, I do apologise. What about these teeny little boppers, 14-year-olds? I'm sure they're going to run around meeting the boyfriends, smelling like rose. Oh, yeah, what have you got on? Oh, Yardley. Lily of the Valley. Look at that, go away, you stink. I'll probably use mine. If, it, if it's quite... I mean, yeah, I listen. No, no, I'll probably use mine as a room... Smelly. I won't do that. In my bathroom or something like that. I will go and put it in the men's bathroom at work. I was just thinking of a combination of spells there. <laughs> but, <coughs> yeah, I'll, I will use it, but, God, no, that's a right old-fashioned brand. It's like saying you're sending us tweed. You know what it reminds me of? What? Ding dong, somebody's calling. No, Yardley were way but yeah, don't know she is before then. Me then. It just reminds me of them. No, Yardley's right old fashioned. But yeah, nine. Thank you very much. I'm very happy. Happy Halloween. I'll sort out my delivery to be a bit better, I think. Uh, I don't know why yet. But the thing was, it was sorted. And they've moved it. But we'll we'll, we'll sort that. Don't know why. So, um I've already emailed them and told them that I want my air product and my Whiffy wappy things. <laughs> you can have mine if you want, because I don't want to end up like Bugby. I do. I have to beat mine down. That's not the point, we can get it. Yeah, yeah, no, you should have all the items. So, yeah. Uh, so, overall, yeah, very satisfied with that box. Well done for promising and promising and coming back with something. And you know, that's, I think that's Keep the best... Keep them! Keep them! Keep them! Can we have more bath bombs? We like a bath bomb. Or bath Milk, product. chocolate or sweets. But can we avoid a bit of rose? Just, just just, for a bit. Can we have some other flavours, please? Yes. Um, so, guys, <clears throat> I must love you and leave you now because I have a handful of boxes over there that need recording. We're going to be here some time. So, from me. I know. <laughs> and, and the Pope. Um, we will see you next month. Uh hopefully what they are going to I be so we'll still be know. here we don't know what else surprises we're going to get apart from the three things we told you about um so yeah <coughs> and i'm going to say it now because i'm a professional person you can say the middle one comment like subscribe and you know why she's saying it because my eight-year-old drummed it into me that i don't say it enough do. watch the previous video of vlogging you will see so right we'll see you next m month on Pink Parcel. Ta-da! Bye. Bye.